Mayor of Bristol Marvin Rees Bristol has made the shortlist, is one of seven cities in the running for Channel 4's new headquarters. However, Plymouth was one of several cities to miss out, both on the shortlist for the broadcast as new headquarters and for one of two further creative hubs, with more than 30 bids submitted in total. Final location will be chosen in October. Marvin Rees, mayor of Bristol, said, We are delighted to have been shortlisted by Channel 4 to become its new national HQ or one of two new creative hubs. Bristol has a culture of innovation which disrupts the norm and has always been a city that makes things happen. We are a city which reflects the diversity of the UK and the globe, with a commitment to inclusion, stretching from our grassroots organizations to the top of political leadership. Channel 4 is built on innovative and distinctive broadcasting which stimulates debate and champions alternative points of view. It is committed to diversity and nurturing new talent to change people's lives. These are values we share and want in Bristol and it is because of this that I believe that Channel 4 would be good for Bristol and Bristol would be good for Channel 4. Now, with our fantastic partners across the city's creative and media sectors, we look forward to welcoming Channel 4 in the coming weeks to show them our talent, creativity and the possibilities of our city. We will discuss how we could work together and develop their vision for the future alongside ours. Plymouth Council took the decision not to progress its bid some time ago. A spokesperson said, while we were hugely excited by the prospect of pitching for Channel 4 to be part of Britain's Ocean City's growing digital media cluster, Plymouth City Council and its partners took the decision five weeks ago not to progress the bid as it was clear that they were looking for a much larger city, with a range of more established production companies, and much larger budgets. We remain extremely proud of the growing number of creative organizations that are being nurtured in this city and will continue to concentrate our resources on supporting them and looking for opportunities to help them thrive, Channel Fa's Chief Commercial Officer. Jonathan Allen, said, We've been incredibly impressed both by the number of pitches we received and by the high quality of the submissions, which has underlined the huge amount of creativity, innovation and talent right across the UK. However we have to move to a short list phase and, after careful consideration by the Channel 4 executive team, we've selected 13 cities that are best able to meet our vision for our new hubs in the nations and regions. We look forward to visiting all those on the short list as part of our second phase, but we will also be continuing to work with all cities and regions as part of our strategy to increase investment and support creative businesses, jobs and growth across the UK.